The man is talking on the phone. The woman is sitting on a bench. The man has a newspaper. He is at the immigration. Look at the picture below and choose the sentence that describes the correct answer. 1. A. The man is taking photos. B. The man is walking the street. C. The man is talking to a friend. D. The man is calling his friend. 2. A. The woman is working in the office. B. The woman is running on the street. C. The woman is weightlifting at the gym. D. The woman is dancing. 3. A. He is rowing a boat. B. He is snorkeling in the sea. C. He is surfing in the sea. D. He is surfing in the river. 4. A. She is playing the cello. B. She is playing the piano. C. She is singing a song. D. She is playing the guitar. The men are at the boarding gate. Everyone has a laptop computer. 5. A. They are in the office. B. They are raising their glasses. C. They are working. D. They are eating their lunch. 6. A. They are having dinner. B. They are all men. C. Everyone has a laptop computer. D. There is a man standing. 7. A. They are outside. B. They are listening to the instructor. C. The instructor is sitting. D. There are drinks on the table. 8. A. One child is crying. B. The mother is laughing. C. There are three children. D. The children are all girls. 9. A. The plane is landing. B. The plane is taking off. C. The helicopter is flying. D. There are many planes on runways. 10. A. People are horseback riding. B. The horses have saddles. C. One of the horses is white. D. There is a farmer. 11. A. The train has left. B. The train is coming. C. There are only few people waiting. D. There are waiting for the bus. 12. A. The museum is empty. B. People are listening to music. C. People are looking at paintings. D. There are statues on display. You will hear a question or statement in three responses spoken in English. They will not be printed in your test book and will be spoken only one time. Select the best response to the question or statement and mark the letter A, B, or C on your answer sheet. 1. Where is the personal department? A. It's on the fifth floor. B. It is not here. C. You made it. 2. When did he come? A. He came by bus. B. He is absent. C. At 9.30. 3. What seems to be the trouble? A. I have a stomachache since last night. B. I have a travel plan for summer. C. You should stop it. 4. Why is Mr. Jones not here yet? A. Yes, he came to the station. B. He's stuck in the traffic jam. C. I come to the meeting. 5. How many copies do we need? A. At 4.30. B. About 50. C. On the corner. Do you have any work experience? Yes, I worked at a bank for two years. May I help you? I'm looking for a sweater. The president is in the meeting, isn't he? No, he's in his office. 
Six. Can I see the invoice? A. No, I can't. B. Sure, here you are. C. Thank you for lending. Seven. Is the paper ready for the presentation? A. Yes, it was a great presentation. B. Yes, it's ready. C. No, I didn't see it. Eight. Do you have anything to declare? A. No, nothing. B. You have something? C. Yes, I'm preparing. Nine. Would you like some dessert? A. Yes, I'd like some tea, please. B. Yes, she will. C. No, thank you. Ten. Didn't you order extra copies the brochure? A. There were not enough copies. B. No, he didn't. C. Yes, I did. I ordered them yesterday. I won a million yen in a lottery. Lucky you. I'm stressed out. Why don't you take a break from work? I'd like to check in. Certainly. May I see your reservation slip, sir? Eleven. I'll take this red bag. A. Thank you, Mom. That'll be one hundred fifty dollars. B. May I pay with this credit card? C. I'm sorry, we don't carry this line of bags. Twelve. I passed the exam. A. I worked hard. B. You didn't know. C. You made it. Thirteen. I must be going soon. A. I don't know what time it is. B. So soon? Can't you stay a bit longer? C. Thank you for inviting us. Fourteen. Let's meet at noon for lunch on Saturday. A. Saturday night is fine. B. Okay. See you on Saturday. C. When are you free? Fifteen. Jeff bought a new car. A. I bought one. B. He printed business cards. C. What kind is it? Directions. You will hear some conversations between two or more people. You will be asked to answer three questions about what the speakers say in each conversation. Select the best response to each question and mark the letter A, B, C, or D on your answer sheet. The conversations will not be printed in your test book and will be spoken only one time. Good morning. Welcome to the Transnational Hotel. What can I do for you? Good morning. My name is Tom Sanders. I have a reservation for a single room for three nights. All right, Mr. Sanders. Let me pull up your reservation. I can't seem to find a record of your booking. Did you book the room directly through us, or do you use a hotel reservation service or a travel agent? No,、well, I booked it directly through you. I've already also paid a deposit on the first night. I have a, a reservation number if that helps. Yeah, sure. Can I see that, please? Thank you. Oh, I see. Maybe there was a glitch with the booking system. Well, we don't have any more single rooms available, with the exception of one adjoined room. But you would then be right next door to a family with children, which might get noisy. But that's not a problem. I can upgrade you to one of our business suites. They all come with jacuzzis. Oh,、well, that sounds nice.、Uh, but how much more is that going to cost? That would, of course, be at no extra charge to you. Oh, well, thank you. My pleasure. One. How many nights is he staying? Two. How did he book the room? Three. What kind of room is he getting? This is Jason. How can I help you this afternoon? You tell me. I'm looking at my new statement, and I see that you people have charged me again for the same fees I've been calling about for months now. I'm sick and tired of being told that it's handled when pretty clearly it's not. I'm so sorry to hear that. Let me take a look at your account and find out what's going on. Can you remind me when this started? Fine. The first fee showed up three months ago. If you can't fix this, I'm going to close the account. I completely understand your frustration. Let me see what I can do to help get this taken care of for you right now. I'm glad I was able to get that issue taken care of. It may take up to 24 hours for your account to show the changes, but you shouldn't see any more of these fees in the future. Thanks for working with me to figure it out. I want to apologize again for the inconvenience. Thanks, Jason. I appreciate your help. One. What is the problem? Two. When did the problem start? Three. How long does it take to show the changes? 
So tell me a little about yourself, Miss Tanaka. I grew up in Tokyo, Japan, and studied economics at college. Then I worked as a bank teller for two years before coming to the United States. I work well with others. I would like to continue working in banking industry. That's great. As you know, this job is for a personal banker. What would you say are some of your strengths or skills that might help you succeed in this job? My biggest strength is my attention to the details and being courteous. Also, I work well under the pressure. I have a certificate of a financial planner. Wonderful. And what are some of your weaknesses? One of my biggest weaknesses is that I found it difficult to ask for help when I need it. I tend to overload myself. I'd like to change that. I appreciate your honesty, Miss Tanaka. What can you tell me about some of your goals over the next few years? My primary goal is to gain more work experience. I'd also like to learn more about the different aspects of banking. So the position like this would be desirable. One, where is she from? Two, what is the position she's applying? Three, what is her goal over the next few years? Sun Valley Apartments, this is Lindsay. How can I help you? Hi, I'm calling about your apartment at 138 Lincoln Street. Is that apartment still available? Uh, yes, it is. Are you interested? Maybe. I have a few questions first. Sure. Um, how much is the rent and how big is the apartment? The unit rents for $900. Um, it's 900 square feet, so it feels very spacious. It's two bedrooms, two bath, and there is uh, hardwood floors throughout, but there is carpet in the bedrooms. Uh, both bathrooms are full bathrooms with shower heads and a tub. Um, can you tell me about the kitchen? Yeah, um, all appliances are included. Um, the oven, gas stove, microwave, and fridge. All right. Uh, what about the washer and dryer? Uh, yeah, there is a washer and dryer hookup. You just have to provide the washer and the dryer. Okay. Um, is the apartment furnished? It's an unfurnished apartment. Oh, I should also tell you about the parking. You get one spot with your um, unit, um, but there's a lot of street parking as well. Are you interested? I could um, set up an appointment with you. Yeah, that'd be great. Um, let's do Friday. Can we do Friday? Oh, great. Friday's great. Let's do 9 o'clock. Awesome. One, how much is the rent? Two, how is the kitchen? Three. When is the appointment? Part 4. Directions. You will hear some talks given by a single speaker. You will be asked to answer three questions about what the speaker says in each talk. Select the best response to each question and mark the letter A, B, C, or D on your answer sheet. The talks will not be printed in your test book and will be spoken only one time. Get your summer party on at American Sale. Right now, get up to 40% off pools, spas, and patio sets. And for a limited time, get 0% financing for 24 months. Or save $100 on every $1,000 spent. The more you buy, the more you save. Save up to $500 on patio furniture. $500 on above ground pools. $1,000 on spas. But hurry, the sale ends June 28th. American Sale, nine Chicago land locations. Visit americansale.com. One, which items are 40% off? Two, how long will 0% financing last? Three, when does the sale end? Two, a winter storm moving into the Midwest threatens to hit major airports in the region, possibly getting to a slow start for air travelers. 
Heavy rain and low clouds are forecast for Chicago this afternoon, conditions that bring delays to the city's busy O'Hare International Airport. As of 3.55 p.m. Eastern Time, delays averaging more than two hours were hampering flights at O'Hare because of low clouds and poor weather according to the Federal Aviation Administration's website. Conditions in Chicago are expected to deteriorate throughout the day, with rain giving way to ice and snow by mid-afternoon and as much as eight inches of accumulation forecast through Tuesday morning. 4. What is the cause of the flight delays? 5. How many hours of delay are expected? 6. How much snow is forecast for Tuesday? It's not very common to suggest visiting a transit hub, but Grand Central Terminal is more than just a place to catch a train. While nearly one million people walk through every day on their way to work, it's also a popular attraction because of its architecture and history. We can start with admiring the world's largest Tiffany clock on the exterior, or looking at the Zodiac mural up above, one of the city's finest pieces of public art. Here's a fun one. Have a cocktail at the Speakeasy-esque Campbell Bar, which is straight out of the Gilded Age. Talk to your friend on the other side at the Whispering Gallery, and just wander around one of New York's most famous landmarks. A little bonus tip, the basement food court has some really great options like Shake Shack and Magnolia Bakery. 7. How many people walk through the terminal? 8. Where is the world's largest Tiffany clock? 9. Where is the food court? Today I'm putting together my very favorite ingredients to make an absolutely delicious salad. We start out by chopping a pound of fresh Roma tomatoes. You're going to slice up one whole English cucumber. The red onion just gives the salad an amazing pop of color and flavor. Don't skip it. Because we love avocado, we make sure there's plenty of it in here. And in it goes, like I said, lots of avocado. Adding fresh cilantro just makes the salad come alive. And if you're not too keen on cilantro, you can use dill. And we'll still be friends. Now the dressing for this salad is super easy. A generous drizzle of extra virgin olive oil, about two tablespoons of fresh lemon juice, which really keeps the avocado from browning. And we finish it off with a little bit of black pepper and a teaspoon of salt. Just toss everything to combine and that's really all there is to it. Here we go! 10. How many tomatoes are used? 11. What is the ingredient she loves? 12. How much lemon juice is used for the dressing? How portable do you think a projector can be? This is Levis Air. It's iPhone size or pocket size portable, and it's smart. But this Air isn't only a projector, it's a full entertainment system. Included with built-in speaker, Wi-Fi capability, HDMI input, and USB connectivity directly from your phone. Air is small, smart, and super easy to set up. You can turn it on in seconds and connect your device fast. Then Air can wirelessly mirror content from any iOS or Android mobile device. This means you can simply connect the Air to your phone, laptop, or gaming console and turn any flat surface into a silver screen. You can even stream video from your smartphone with the USB cable. And here's the best part. Air will be charging your phone at the same time. Levis Air projects your pictures and videos in brilliant colors and breathtaking contrast. Air delivers two and a half hours of continuous video on a single charge, enough for a full-length movie. Plug in your favorite speaker, and you've got a mobile movie theater to share your movies and TV shows with your friends wherever you want. With Levis Air, no matter what you do or where you are, you'll have a pocket-sized entertainment system right beside you. 13. How big is Lavis Air? 14. Which devices can Air connect to? 15. How long can Air show video continuously?